Hello beautiful eyeshadow lovers, my name is Kaylee Wesley and welcome to my channel. Today I am going through my Pan Nat palette update number one or number two. Number one, number two, number one, number two. I don't know. <laughs> if you like this type of content, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up so I know that you enjoyed it. Please subscribe down below and let me know that you have subscribed. I would love to have a conversation with you. Let's just get on into how I did this month. So my goal with this palette was to use the colors at least 10 times this month. 7 to 10 was my goal. I felt that was very appropriate and I have definitely exceeded that goal. I have I have used this 38 times. I accidentally dug my nail into this right before the video, so sorry. <laughs> but I have used this pearl shade four times. I have been using it as an inner corner or on top of my lid, or even as a highlight. That's where it's at. I have used this shade Conk at least three times. This shade Sunset three times. The shade Marina 11 times. The shade... Seaside, seven times. Siren, four times. Four times. This one, two times. And this one, six times. If you could see my progress there. Like I said, I just did my nail into that. That sucked. So I have had an addiction with this palette. The shadows are very creamy and easy to manipulate by, if you just press them, you can get the entire bottom of it, you know what I'm saying? Like, I just press this down in right here so it looks like I have no progress, but I have used the shade three times. I am planning, by the time June comes, I plan on having an idea of what I'm going to be doing with this palette. This palette is very old in my opinion. It is my oldest palette that I still love to this day, but I would, but it is my goal to hit pan on the first four lightest shades and then hopefully pan on the rest of them or even completely use up the first four shades and hit pan on the last four. I'm not sure, but I am going to have an idea of what to do with it in June. I may get rid of it. I may not. I'm definitely keeping it as a... I'm definitely keeping it as like a background decoration because I absolutely love it. I love the design of it. It is my favorite one out of all of them. But am I going to use it after June is the question. All right. But I absolutely love this palette. It, it definitely deserved the 30 times I used it. I have actually been using these lighter shades right here. This Seaside and Siren right here. I've been using it inside my brows to fill them in a little bit more. And I've actually been using Marina and Seaside, these two light matte shades, in my hairline. A, to use it up faster, and B, because I have thin hair and I need it in my hairline. And in saying that, this is the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know down below if you have a pan matte palette or project pan. I would really be interested in seeing all of your progress. Let me know down below, and I hope you guys have a wonderful and fantastic day. This is the fourth video I'm filming today, so you will see this outfit and makeup a lot throughout the next week. So sorry, not sorry for that. I am in college. I have to pre-film, and when I get a break, I just edit and upload, you know? And next week our finals. So wish me luck. Have a wonderful day. I love you all and I hope to see you soon. See you guys. Bye. Subscribe. <laughs>